Hey friends, welcome back and welcome. If you're new, my name is Lady Cinnamon. Welcome to my channel. I'm super excited today. I am going to be doing a tablescape with Shakespeare's Midsummer Night's Dream as a theme. So I'm participating in this second annual collaboration with our lovely gracious host, Creations by Simone. Her channel is about DIYs, tablescapes. It features cooking in the core halls. So please visit her channel. You will not be disappointed. She is so supporting and lovely and I absolutely love her. There will also be a playlist for all of the other participants in the description bar below. They're awesome. You'll have great wedding tablescape ideas from all of them and you'll be so inspired and for this special occasion. So guys, I brought the lights up so I can show you my tablescape. I wanted it to feel like you were in the forest and you're with Puck the Fairy. So we're gonna go ahead and start from the center. I have this wood piece that will be bringing in that element of a tree and I have some gilded um, unclothed cloches that I'm using that I have one of my waterborne candles and also I have some wildflowers cascading down over this really pretty moss and little items that I have that would make you feel like you're in the forest. <laughs> I also have some water elements that would bring that in also. Everything is layered down on top of a moss and um, a lot of green as a runner and I absolutely love the way it looks. I really want to invoke that feeling. My place setting starts with um, an embossed gold and black salad plate from Z Gallery. Then my, my tableware as far as my dinnerware is just matte black from Kirkland's. I also have a beautiful pure one um, fluted stem in that beautiful watercolor also. And my napkin is the same as well as my gold flatware really to bring in all of those elements that you would have with water and wood and all of those things that you would find in the forest. I also bought in some elements like little pine cones and moss and lots and lots of greenery to make you feel that you're in the forest with the fairy puck and it's full of love and intrigue. I even made my placemats with cabbage to look like you're sitting in cabbage. So I hope I was able to bring this to fruition with the way it looks. I hope you like the way it turned out. Please don't forget to check out the host channel. She's so lovely and supportive and I absolutely love her. <laughs> I will leave her and all of the other participants information and links in the description bar below. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. It helps my channel so much. And also, I hope to see you all in the next video. Hit the bell twice if you'll be subscribing so you'll know whenever I upload. And thank you all for watching.